expedition is a series of all women's sailing voyages to different parts of the world to really study plastic pollution, the toxic impacts on our ocean, and to bring together an amazing group of women to think about how we can tackle these problems. This expedition is X Expedition North Pacific. We'll be sailing from Hawaii to the North Pacific Gyre this accumulation zone between Hawaii and Vancouver, where so much plastic ends up. What we know so far about the Great Pacific Garbage Patch is there is this accumulation zone between 20 and 40 degrees north of the equator, and in the middle of that patch, it is the most dense. I've never been out there before, so from what I've heard, it's, it's vast. There are quotes twice the size of Texas, twice the size of France. The previous notion was that it was all microplastics and you couldn't see it. Someone's talked about an island of trash, that's not true either. Some of the crew might be quite surprised when we get there and we realize that actually it's this very fine soup. And you often look at the water and it appears to be clean. We take the trawl through and we pull up a thousand pieces of plastic. I think it's hard for people to believe uh, who haven't necessarily studied plastic pollution actually what's out there. There's over five trillion fragments of plastic floating on the surface of our ocean and there's many times that that have sunk to the depths so deep that we can't even measure. We've got a really uh, wide-ranging science program so we're looking at plastics in the water on the surface um, we're also looking at toxins in the water and then microplastic contamination in the air. We have over 10 different scientific experiments going on on board. I'm going to help out the science team to do the actual sampling because that's something I really want to learn more about. But I'm also part of the expert team coming from Tamra and knowing what I know about how we can recycle beverage containers and keep them out of the ocean and how we can have those land-based solutions to make sure that we sort of close the tap of litter on land uh, while we also work out at sea. When it comes to solutions, I really think there's no silver bullet. There's not one solution to this problem. It has to be many different solutions all along the value chain. The good news is that there's many things that we can be doing to tackle ocean plastic. And for me, it's all about trying to get as close to the source of the problem as we can. We know that there's so many tiny fragments of plastic in our ocean and on our coastlines. Trying to pick them up is near impossible. So trying to turn off the tap, work at the source and stop that plastic getting into the ocean in the first place is really where we need to focus our energy. We need governments working on legislation. We need industry designing new products. And we need new systems like Tomra working on deposit return schemes. And we also need individual action. We need all of us as consumers to think about our plastic consumption, shift our behavior, and really work together to solve the problem.